Why are you helping me? I have my reasons. And why won't they let me be with Elise? All I know is, the amount of resources they've used, keeping you from her is pretty damn important to them. You're going to look for her, aren't you? You won't find her. They'll make sure of it. Even if they weren't trying to stop you, there are nine million people in this city. You'll never find her. Forget about her. Move on with your life. Stop the bus. Elise? Elise, hi. David. You know, I rode the M6 to work every day for three years, hoping that I'd bump into you. Uh, uh, listen, is there a place we could go and, um, and talk? Don't you have to get to work or something? I just got sick. I haven't seen you in three years. You make me sick. That's not an ideal come on, just so you know. <laughs> what are you looking for? No, I just uh, felt like someone was watching us. Uh, hey, uh, uh, Charlie, I'm going to have to skip breakfast, and I probably have to postpone the speech, too. I just bumped into Elise. You just hung up on your friend. Yeah, but we've known each other since we were kids. What we speech? have a shorthand. Doesn't matter. You want to take a walk? No. We have a lot to catch up on. I don't on. think you should cancel your speech. What if I don't like you at the end of our walk? I'll take my chances. Well, seriously, my number hasn't changed. Just call me like you didn't last time. No, look, if you take a walk with me, I'll explain why. It's been years. How do you know I don't have a nice boyfriend? Uh, do you have a nice boyfriend? Would it matter if I did? Yeah. Oh, so you don't have any real conviction, then? <laughs> OK, it wouldn't matter at all. Oh, so, you don't, so you don't mind being a home wrecker? <laughs> Stop like that. How you doing, man? I'm from Red Hook. You're the best. Thank you. Good to see you. Well, OK, if you were married, then it would bother me. But now you're just saying what you think I want to hear. <laughs> I'm single. Now let's hear your bullshit excuse for not calling me. I didn't have your number. I gave it to you on the bus, handed no. it to you. I was mugged. It was taken from me. No, come no, on. No, my wallet was taken. They took come it. Come on. Look, why else would I fawn all over you on a bus three years ago and then never call you? Because, I don't know, you have a girlfriend. You felt terrible and. OK, listen, I swear to you that I did not have your number. Right. OK, listen, no. I, on my parents' graves. That's heavy. That's too heavy, I know. But it's true. I, I, didn't ha I didn't have your number. And I didn't even have a last name to go by. You know, if you Google just Elise, you get 757,000 hits, and none of them are you. 